We're gonna play uh, Flaming Groovies. Don't put me on. That's the song. From the start, I knew you'd miss the point. So I, I think I'll smoke a joint. Fun, real fun song, and uh, starts in D minor. There's two guitars in this band. Okay, it's kind of like a, what I would call proto punk because they, these guys were around before punk, and they were really, uh, and then they were part of the punk uh, movement, and then they were after too. This was uh, 1978. This song came out, so that's right at the end of the heyday of punk. The original punk. So we get D minor to C, F to B flat. You could play this whole song in power chords. repeats four times actually and then that makes up a verse and then uh, the chorus is C play it in this in power chords don't it put me B flat to G C also probably play that like this um, from the start because there was two um, there was two uh, guitars in this group so you could play uh, this partial uh, D minor it's just frets uh, five six seven at your E, B, G. You could add your pinky in there and, and double up on the uh, seven if you want on the D string. And we could go to uh, an A shaped power chord here. Just the same A that you learned here. Just move it to the fifth fret. And it works. Just hit strings four, three, and two. Then it goes to an F. Okay, we can play that like this. That's uh, your first, your index finger on the B string at the first fret, your middle finger at the uh, G string on the second fret, and your uh, ring finger at the D string on the third fret. There's your F. Smoke a joint. <laughs> and then it goes to B flat. And you could play that again with your A shaped. Just move it up to the third fret. But the way a, a lot of people do it, you'll see it if you watch them play guitar, is uh, I think one of my strings is out of tune. But they play it like this, uh, the F shape, and then they just flatten the third finger. And that allows you to make real quick changes between chords that are on your sixth and fifth frets, the roots. So we can go G, G C, or C, C, G. It's uh, real easy to do. Uh, the, the, uh, a lot of the lead guitar is based out of these chord shapes. They're just, when they're just playing fills. You know, one card's play, one guitar's playing the chords, and the other's going. They're just playing those two, uh, the B and the G string, using those partial shapes I showed you. And then um, playing a lot in this um, 
D minor pentatonic. Uh, remember, we started the first chord in the song is D minor, and the, the melody, I believe, is in D minor. But that, D, remember, D minor is the relative minor of uh, F. So you could also say it's in F major. And they're just doing like a lot of like kind of like Chuck Berry type of riffs and real uh, like Roots Rock kind of riffs. They do this at the end of the song for like 30 seconds straight. So uh, that's a great song. Have fun with it. Uh, they had it one hit, I think, in 76. Reached, you know, like the top 200 um, in the U.S. And I think it was called Shake, Shake Me. Um, and, uh, you know, they had groups uh, like The Clash opening up for them, you know, when The Clash first started out. So these guys are more like garage rock that kind of turned into uh, the punk and the new wave after that. So thanks for watching, bye.